talking about sns airdrop i want to show us how to see if you are eligible for sns airdrop so there are three major platforms that we're going to make use of to check our eligibility and number one is open chat oc.app you can see oc.app so let's go oc.app so once it loads then you see your you know your account so which means you must have been running your account and be active you know chatting with friends chatting on groups sharing your links and all stuff like that so that's just it now this sns airdrop you can first check through this your open chat um, if you're eligible so it has to do with your activeness you have to be active search for this come to this search group search for sns one underscores bot sns one underscores bot can you see that's the sns one underscores bot so you click on it so you chat with the bot you don't need to do anything serious just paste your principal id so how do we get that principal id that's the next thing we want to do so you let's go back you go to your profile can you see this is my profile this is my picture so you scroll down and when you scroll down and you will look for what we call user id that's your canister id or your principal id so you can copy it okay so you're good so once copied you can go back to this your uh, sns1 underscores bot underscores bot you're going to send your principal id to it and let's see the response so it's going to be a response that yeah, okay you're eligible or oh, unfortunately you're not eligible okay it says i'm not eligible for the sns uh, one airdrop so last for how to check your eligibility on open chat so another platform we visit is what we call discover that website discover.one discover dscvr dot o n e so dot one so you're going to see it's going to load uh it and if you're starting afresh you need to connect your wallet through your fingerprint because that's uh an internet identity uh means of connection you get to discover like this okay you must have been active using this discover platform for you to be eligible for sns address. so of course we log in through fingerprint which is also called internet identity now let's go you go up to this uh, top left you come to these are portals portals is just like servers on discord it's just like groups on facebook so you now scroll down you look for explorer explorer that means you want to explore portals now there's this portal we are going and it's sns dash one sns dash one sns dash one you scroll down look at the portal so i have joined already okay so if you are not you, know, you have not just click on join so you click on this so when you click it you have access to that portal so you see what is happening in the portal so now let me just show you this just look for their recent post this was posted by them so you can come there and come to the comment section this is comment so on the comment section thanks and post so when you click on thanks post um, you'll see your name on the list of the commenters but let's say that uh, aside this you can look at others post now uh, this is my post it says i said i said thanks so let me you now click on your profile click on it then it will tell you your position so i'm a member of this server but i don't hold sns1 airdrop or token look at this person is highlighted in red while i'm highlighted in green see green let's say you click on the red 
this Betty uh, Niamia. So click on it. It says the person is an SNS holder. Can you see? Let's go check the third, third one. This is my district app. It's just like Twitter. Can you see the difference? So open chat on ICP is like Telegram. While district app on ICP is like Twitter. White Discover is just like Facebook. Now let's go. You come to this top left, then you come to NFT dashboard. I'm clicking on view, then I'll get my principal ID. So I copy. So which means I've copied. Then let, let's go back to this place. Our open chat. So on the open chat, I'm going to communicate with the boat again. Let's see, we click on this. Now, when I click on this, it says registrations are no longer open. It's when I sent this, then it said, unfortunately, you are not eligible for SNS address. So on the three platforms, I am not eligible. The last place to check, let's go to our browser, is where we call NNS nns.ic0.app so i'm going to run it okay i'm going to log in with my fingerprint network never system so sign in with your identity of internet or internet identity all right so i'm i've signed in I've signed in Now, this is the last place to check if you're eligible for SNS airdrop. So, you now come to this top right. Then, you now come to Neurons. Take note. Neurons. So, it's going to load. Take note. Then, when it loads, you now come to this nervous system. Network nervous system. Click on it. Now, click on SNS1. That's the last place to check. So when I got here, I saw that, oh, I have access to SNS1 airdrop. So I checked on open chat, not eligible. I checked on discover, discover, not eligible. I checked on um, Dick Street, not eligible. But when I checked my neurons, probably it noticed my fingerprint on those platform. And that's why. I am eligible there. Over six hundred dollars, although we are still on the locking phase, and I'm sure by the time the locking uh, a period is over, the price would have dipped so bad. So this is not an instant cash out for anybody. So, but it's good money. Money. So take note of accidents. That's where to sell it. But let's say you want to vote. This is the last thing I want to show us. So you come to this place, take note. I also share this link with us. How to vote on Discover. This one was set up by Discover team. How to vote on SNS1 proposals. So this is it. You scroll, you go to your Discover profile and copy your principal ID. So you come to this top right. So on this top right, you click on your profile. And when you click on your profile, uh, it it loads. So once it's done loading, this is my principal ID. You can see. So you copy it. So when you copy it, you now go back to uh, your place. So before I start dissolving, so I'm going to add alt key. I'm going to add. So take note of that again. I'll run that again under this new run. Don't forget how we got there. Then you click on add alt key. Then you paste your principal ID and you confirm. So once you're done confirming, uh, that's all. You can still add more depending on where you want to vote. So I have a one voting power. This is one of the proposal, first proposal. It said uh, for adding a new generic nervous system to upload assets to SNS1 DAP, which is important for the progress. So I'm going to vote accept. I've accepted. 